The RSA virus was a DOS virus that infects .com and .exe files, and when it's memory resident, it also uh, adds a virus dropper to all uh, zip files that are created using pkzip. Now, pkzip is basically just the one of the very first file compressors that actually made file compression very popular in this zip format very preferable and easier to use. Now, I managed to find this program so I could show you this virus's cool payload, which is a pretty cool graphical, graphical effect, which is akin to the LSD virus. Now, if we go ahead and run the RSA virus, you see it becomes memory resident. And now, if we create a zip archive, we'll just uh, And we'll package the virus with it. Now that should create. Alright, let's see if we do a dir command. Let's see, we have our virus.zip zip file. Now if we pk unzip equal and slash pk zip. Wait, pk, yeah, pk, zip, slash, virus, dot, zip, say that three times fast, I don't know, I don't really care if you can say that three times fast or not, I just said it because I had nothing better to say, Let's see if that works, uh, yeah, go ahead and overwrite the virus, I don't really care, you'll see it extracted, virus and coolbbs.com see dir slash w we have coolbbs.com let's go ahead and run it and this is a virus dropper that when activated will drop the virus onto any system that runs it and that is the graphical effect is a large flame on your screen and as you can see it's a lot higher definition than what you would expect on DOS as it turns the computer to graphics mode it's basically the same thing that LSD does, but LSD is a lot prettier. This is a lot more awesome! And that's about it for the RSA.com verse. It goes back to DOS after that.